Joshua. Laura, Shane, I love you. And I miss you so much. Something to eat or something? No. Maybe a little nothing. juice? No. Okay, well, how about you let me know when you do? And you go inside now and take a little rest, all right? Okay. Okay. You were great with her. I just can't help but think about what we're doing to her. What, giving her an existence she never would have otherwise had? And now you're giving her a past. Everything that you just told her is now part of her memory. Not her memory, my memory, told from my point of view. Well, she'll remember the events. That's a lot. I, I, I might as well be telling her uh, fairy tales. Michael, it's not real. It, it, it's like we're brainwashing her, and, and it's a horrible thing. It's wrong. Why do you have to keep looking for the negative? I'm trying. I'm not looking for them. They keep on slapping me in the face. So you look past them. You look ahead. I'm trying. Look, you told me that Mara and Shane are desperate to have their mother back. If you stick with this, they will. Cassie will have her sister, and you no, will have your no, wife. No one's going to have Reva back because she's gone, Michael. Look. Only if you let her go. Well, maybe that's what I should have done in the first place when I first... I, I don't know why I even let you start this thing. I really don't. Well, you let me, and I did. And there's no turning back. Yeah, I'm very much aware of that. Thank you. Can't you take some small satisfaction in the fact that we created a <sighs> wonderful life? This, this precious child. This precious child's life is a lie. It's a horrible lie. Well, congratulations. Well, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, what's the matter, Cassie? You can't even look at me? I'd rather not. I think it would be nice if we could have, make some kind of peace, don't you? I've heard that song before. Matter of fact, you just sang it to heart, and I don't want to hear it again. Well, if Cassie feels that way, I guess I should steer clear of you, too. Yeah. I'm glad everything worked out. Thank you. You're welcome. Look, Dr. Jessup has come up with a, a diagnosis for what ails you. So what do I have? You, uh, you have uh, slight edginess and uh, a little paranoia. Well, can it be treated? Fortunately, I, I uh, have come up with a treatment, and it is a week in Aruba. And before you say no, I already have the tickets, and we're going. Justice for all. Well, if that were the case, then you would have handed me over the tape that would clear Abby. One hand washes the other. Well, I should have known better than to think you were actually becoming human. Oh, I'm human. We both are. 